우선 지속가능한 성장을 위해서는 안전은 우리 회사의 기본이고 경영의 제일 원칙입니다. 지금까지 우리 임직원 모두가 각자 맡은 역할을 성실히 수행하는 것이 안전의 출발임을 확인하고 실천해 왔습니다. 25년에는 회사의 사분 물론이고 우리의 현장, 내 업무에 있어서 계획 단계부터 면밀히 살펴보고 위험을 사전 조치하는 활동에 집중해야 하겠습니다. 경영 환경이 불확실하고 어려울수록 안전, 이 기본에 더욱 집중해야 흔들리지 않고 나아갈 수 있습니다. 임직원 여러분 새해 복 많이 받으세요. A top-down approach emphasizes the critical role of leadership in driving and sustaining a strong safety culture through mentoring. Safety is the top priority of business. Top priority of business. Influence of senior leaders to instill safety values and practices throughout the organization. By actively mentoring employees at lower levels, leaders demonstrate their commitment to safety, fostering a culture where safety is not just a policy, but a deeply ingrained value. All of our workers have the right to stop the work if the workplace unsafe. When worker observes an unsafe site, stops the work and reports to HSE zone in charge person. Zone in charge person will report in right to stop work, WhatsApp group, HSE, department, PIC attend immediately, follow up on corrective and preventive action. Effective safety training is paramount for CR112 project. Especially when subcontractors are involved, a collaborative approach ensures that all personnel, regardless of their employer, are aligned with the project's safety standards and procedures. CR112 has a safety culture where we subcontractors uh, conduct and also share work activities during our TPM uh, to make others understand and also aware of the hazards involved in their works. It is also a good exposure for subcontractors to showcase uh, their works. Okay, I say a good practices on site. Conduct periodic refresher training to ensure workers practice essential skills and techniques addressing common errors or challenges. An update on changes in procedures, regulations or best practices. It helps reduces the risk of errors and accidents. Comprehensive virtual reality VR training provides interest, in-depth understanding of a particular activity scenario. VR allows trainees to make mistakes and learn from them without endangering themselves in reality. Daily temperature check. Daily exercise. Daily activity briefing, LMRA, last minute risk assessment, briefing, continue work, daily coordination meeting, cool zone provided for workers to manage heat stress on site, ice cube machine provided for daily water parade. Gray area inspection. Work and meeting. Everybody okay? I'm okay. Sir. CCMS. CCMS identifies daily manpower, equipment, high risk activities updated by Samsung and subcontractor supervisors. Ultimately, 
CCMS enhances daily safety work cycle for a safer workplace. Today the manpower is 414. Today we have 11 activities with 38 equipment. When the mechanical limit switch rotates, as the gantry crane passes by, the lifting alarms are activated, and magnetic lock at the access gates are automatically activated too. Lifting supervisor ensure that no one stand under the suspended load at launching shaft area. When the crane moves out from the launching shaft, the alarm is off and the door is unlocked automatically. The auto alarm system serves as an essential safety feature, providing timely warning alerts to everyone during lifting activities. By using remote control to open and close, the retractable enclosure enhances the Vector Control Initiative, prevention of rainwater accumulation, minimizing stagnant water, uninterrupted work schedule during rainy weather. Enclosure acts as a visual screen, helps in visual disturbance and secondary noise minimization in launching shaft work area. The ECM treatment plants operate by treating silty water into clean water. Clean water is monitored by TSS sensor and reading should be maintained less than 50 milligrams per liter. This ECM treated water discharge is monitored by PUBSIDS. If the ECM discharged silty water to the public drain, here is the auto silt stopper we fixed. As the TSS reading reaches above 40 mg per liter, auto silt stopper will close immediately the outlet valve within 10 seconds. The silty water flows back to the ECM holding pond. It prevents silty water discharge into the public drain.